Welcome back. This week, farmers and ranchers attending the American Farm Bureau Federation's annual convention in Nashville were treated to an address from President Trump. In tonight's Montana Ag feature, MTN's Russell Nimitz shares what the president said and reaction from Montana producers in attendance. You know, the last sitting president to speak to the American Farm Bureau Federation was President George H.W. Bush 25 years ago. Agriculture Secretary Sonny Perdue welcomed President Trump to this year's convention and said that his attendance sends a very strong message to rural America. It's an indication of what this president thinks about your organization and you as people and what you do for the United States economy. Once on stage, the president didn't waste any time in praising farmers and ranchers for their enduring values. Each of you carries the same title that's been proudly borne by patriots and pioneers, inventors and entrepreneurs, the title of, very proudly, American Farmer. Thank you very much. In addition to economic development, Trump touched on issues of importance to farmers and ranchers, like tax reform. One of the things that I'm really interested in, of course, is the inheritance of the family farm. And that mean, means so much to me, and my son and daughter-in-law are helping now with the ranch. And to know that that succession, and to my grandchildren, will still continue, means the world to me. The president also said that with every decision his administration makes, they're honoring America's proud farming legacy. Years of crushing taxes, crippling regulations, and it's never been worse than it was before I got here. It was horrible. And corrupt politics left our communities hurting. This, too, resonated well with farmers and ranchers in attendance, especially young producers. There's some optimism in agriculture just based on rolling back some of the rules and the regulations that we're facing every day, allowing producers to, to get back to work, to doing what they do, feeding the world and, and taking care of their family and their operations. As for the new farm bill, the president promised it would continue to provide a safety net for producers who are now entering their fifth year of declining incomes. I'm Russell Nimitz, MTN News.